Good morning. It's Hitman Friday. Uh, we don't have any special, super special thing to do, so I'm just gonna play a bunch of Hitman. A uh, bunch of um, escalations, featured contracts, uh, stuff that I've missed over the last few months. Um, there is an elusive target coming up um, next week, although I'm going to have to do it the week after because these things launch at, at local time, 2 o'clock, which is two, hour, 2 hours after I stream on Fridays. Um, let's actually have a look because it says the broker number 2. Now the broker is um, a target from Hitman 1, but I don't remember doing it in Hitman 3. Maybe I'm wrong. No. Why are they calling it number two? Don't know. It would just be the same. I've done it in Hitman 1, I've done it in Hitman 2, I think. So it's the one with the Fabergé egg. Um, yeah, it's a good one. I've enjoyed that one in the past. Right. Um, we're going to do the Cupid, like Valentine's Day featured contracts, because I did one of them, but there are two more left to do. Game modes. Featured. Okay, Cupid's Catalyst is the next one. So, read the briefing. Long distance relationships can be difficult. Luckily, long range weaponry is much easier to manage. That's why Cupid wants you to keep your distance and ensure that Miss Feng is well protected. Four suspicious individuals in Chongqing, Chongqing have been overheard asking about the whereabouts of a woman with a bright green bag. Cupid wants you to take no chances and change no disguises on this one. Okay. So keep my suit. Don't get recorded. And kill these four people. Three of them with a sniper rifle and one of them with a full accident. A full accident means I should be able to knock them out and then turf them over the edge. As for a sniper rifle, I will put that as a smuggled item. I think I can put them as a, as a smuggled item up in the... I don't know. Actually, where, do I, where can I start? Maybe I'm locked into starting in a certain way. The balcony, that's what I want, actually, because that's going to start me up high. And so I probably want to smuggle... Facility rooftops are not good, because I've got to sneak past a bunch of shit to get there. In the laundry is a stash only, so I can't take the sniper rifle. Hey, Dyer. Hey, welcome back. Thanks for joining. Um, actually, I guess I'm going to hold my sniper rifle in my thematically appropriate briefcase. I'm going to take the green eye, because that's the, the new hotness. 2am, mate. Alright, well. I'll be on for a bit, but probably longer than you will. <laughs> I'm doing the Valentine's Day featured contracts, which is like the newest thing that's been added to the game. Um, I guess I'll put in the laundry because that's near where I'm going to be. I'm going to put... I don't really need anything, do I? I don't really need anything at all. <laughs> yeah, see if you can stay up until four. <laughs> Going hunting. Alright, see how this goes. Four targets, three with a sniper rifle, one with an accident, full, without changing my disguise, or being seen by cameras. Alright. I just checked you, you actually followed me about a month ago, so thank you for coming back. Really appreciate it. Where's my targets? Ow. 
Maybe I should have started over there. Oh crap, this is actually going to be a pain in the ass. I'm actually going to get down to, to ground, but can I get down to ground with my briefcase? I think I can, actually. Um, that guy is probably the falling guy, and then these three... That's actually really an awkward place for me to, <laughs> to kill him with a sniper rifle. Okay, but the good thing is he keeps his briefcase, because it's never clear to me what what agility kind of action is going to cause him to leave behind his briefcase. Vaulting through shit. Fine. I actually don't know where all the cameras are on this level, so... Let's see. There we go. Um, I'm going to go this way because I can get up the ladders. Actually get a bit of a clearer picture of where... I can take these guys out with a sniper rifle. I'm not sure if that's going to be street level or up on the rooftop here. However, I may not be able to get the briefcase up there. How the fuck? Oh, I actually kind of know what I could do. I could get them through here. Um, so I've got two YouTube channels, so I've got the one in my name, which is where I archive most stuff, and then um, also go play that, which is a group, yes, um, group's a little bit inactive at the moment, but all the um, all the elusive target stuff I, I publish up there for a larger audience. I'm not allowed up here, cool. But there's loads of archived stuff on there. We did two 24-hour live streams, a um, bunch of other stuff. Uh, how am I going to do this? Uh, and then the cameras. Okay. Oh, there's another. Maybe I should have used something that would. Oh shit. Would have been a thrown knockout. Oh, I've got the can actually. If you had the money for just a fraction of protecting one of those, I seriously doubt you'd be standing out here Ooh. in the rain right now. Okay. So no drone flood right in. I'm gonna knock yeah, out no. the target. I still like watching them. And then I'm gonna drag this guy. And this should count as a fall. Excellent kill. There you go. Does. Does indeed. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. What? Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. I'm not. No, not affiliated. No. Appreciate it, but no, I haven't set up anything for subscriptions or bits or anything. Oh, he's found the body. Maybe I need to kill this guy. It's probably easier. I should be. Well, I appreciate that. Thank you. We'll see how things go. <laughs> Definitely streaming often enough. All right, I th uh, yes, I think this is how we do this. I don't know if this sniper is this sniper rifle silent. I think it is. Yeah. So what if I were? To oh, I don't have anything to throw. If I had something to throw, briefcase. That briefcase to throw. No, no, oh, actually, he's walking away. He is walking away. Um, and this is the other target, isn't it? And then we just got this last target here. Um, there's a bunch of people 
in between. Oh, he's... Oh, that's the, that's the dead body. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to conceal my sniper rifle and just um, chill for a moment. After he's dealt with the body, he should be... Actually, he's going to move it down here, which is potentially perfect. Because as he's doing his drag, I can take him out. Okay, step back. I'll go into Yeah, this might work. Okay, they're going into they're, those people are going down, so they're going into the facility. Okay. Oh god, this Just around the corner. Hey, Mr. Bronze. Boosh. Let's get out of here. Not that way. Probably not that way either. That's back where I've left the trail of bodies. So I'm going to go to the train station. Just got to be really careful of cameras. It's my only way to fail right now. familiar with that exit up there. It's apparently closer, but it's also up high, which is not necessarily simple. Right. Um, okay. Look out for cameras. And then after this, we'll get the last Valentine's Day featured contract. Which I think takes place in Dartmoor. There we go. Safe. No, no, no. There you go. Yeah. Alright. Got a few more watches. Good morning slash good late, late evening. All right. Yes, yes, yes. Tick, 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 tick. Okay. Let's jump out of that one and over to the last one. That was pretty fast. Yes, I was just warming up. <laughs> Um, back to feature contracts, and we got the last one, Cupid's Conclusion, in Dartmoor. Uh, let's read. If at first you don't succeed, Cupid has learnt that the two lovers of Dartmoor are once again under threat and wants you to complete one final contract, unbeknownst to the entire world until now. Ken Takuchi is a man with ulterior motives. His expertise as a gardener was simply an easy way for him to travel the world, eliminate the competition, and leave with a rock-solid alibi. His arrival at the Dartmoor Garden Show ah, is believed to be an attempt to seek revenge against a, a certain Mr. Taylor who cheated Ken out of millions in their childhood, preserve the lives of the Dartmoor lovers, and allow love to prevail. This is going to take place in a special version of Dartmoor, which was the garden show, which was like a summer thing last year, so that's cool. Dartmoor is in Devon, yes. Yes. That's why I didn't recognise that picture, I was like, that's not Dartmoor. Um, holy smokes, okay. Oh, this sounds more difficult. Don't change your disguise, do not get caught on camera. No bodies found, that's like one of the trickiest complications in the game. Does not include accidents. Okay, that's why this works. So kill Cyril. This is our main guy. And then Sato is on the scene. Oops. Um. Okay. Accidents are... Are not... 
Ooh, difficult. I want to find things like screwdrivers and... Um, what else can I use? Well, I can use a gas device and then... Tick and boot, but I want to take that as a smuggled device. Smuggled device? Um, agency pickup at the graveyard. <laughs> sure. And it's a tool. And then... Explosive accident. No. Spontaneous combustion doesn't count as an accident. However, a poison would. So, if I stick him with a lethal syringe, that would do it. So we'll give that a go. Let's try that. If it doesn't work out, then... Um, deterministic mode. What in the name? Choose your own targets among those eligible on each level. Activate by choosing this starting location on level 1. Okay. Can't show you skies. Nobody's found. No. Cameras. Yum, yum, yum. Targets are other side of the level. So, start by getting my briefcase. I think the heel on this shoe is coming loose. I cannot catch a break. I've been meaning to ask. So start more fashion now. Am I pulling it off? Oh my god. Have I told you how stunning you look yet? It's like you invented that whole part. Okay. I've never picked something up at the graveyard before. It is too sunny. It would be that one day in summer. I'm allowed to walk around the graveyard. Okay, well, that does make sense, actually. The baseball. Ah, it's going to be behind this wall. And I'll take a brick. You know, just in case. Although no, no bodies found, that includes... Right, so here's the trick that I've been using and abusing for a while. Oh, I can't do it in front of people. I'm shy. <laughs> Um, is I retrieve the thingy and then I conceal it back in. That then triggers it to be activated as in the briefcase and then I can just um, hold on to the detonator. Scythe. Hello. Amber weather warning. Oh dear. Oh, you. How are you, sir? You are an amber weather warning. <laughs> Floods. Oh my god. Dude, stay safe. Not much I can do to help, I'm afraid. Okay. Let's scout out. I'm gonna put this detonator away. The red tr trigger is right there. Hey, what's up? These are the two that I need to kill. Ah! A... Uh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hello there. Hello. Do, are these guys on their own, more or less? No, these two. Okay, well, one of them can get killed by the falling... Um... thingamajig. The other one... I can take out with the gas. Let's see who the third target is. Oh, he's up there. Oh, hey, dude. To see you. I think I killed him with a microphone or something. So, I should focus on this guy with the accident using the briefcase because this guy I can kill any, any way I want. I just need to avoid him. Maybe I can get them both under the sh under the falling thing. Okay, here we go. 
I love it. Huh. He's gonna have a sickie. Don't just be sick. Have a good day, sir. Can you be sick somewhere private, please? Uh -huh. Hold it. Oh, he, uh, I'm not like a weapons He guy, might get sick somewhere I'm not allowed to be. And, uh, I don't think. <laughs> Who? Stand Ooh. back, please. I will investigate. What are you going to investigate? There's nothing. You must be kidding me. A weapon? Holy shit. Ah. Oh, but the toilet's here. Don't worry. Shit, son. It happens to the best of us. Oh, I'm not sure I fucking hide him here. Hey! Oh. Quickly! Okay. That's a one. I'm gonna carry the briefcase. What completely irresponsible person would leave a weapon lying around? What weapon? What weapon? <gasps> no. Me. <laughs> Despite my accent, I'm not in England, so I'm safe from the weather problems. Where can I hide and shoot? Can I do it over the wall? Very un England, that weather. Okay. Ah. Oh. Can I get behind this guy and just stick him with my poisson? I will try. For now, I'm going to hide my briefcase in case I want it as a throwing device. Okay. It's illegal to have a syringe. Which makes all sorts of sense. Maybe I can poison the guy and then get this guy to stand underneath that. That might be the play, actually. Can I stand behind this guy? No, he's too close to the edge. Uh, actually. Oh, <laughs> sorry. A little bit of constructive criticism. You could use a mint. <laughs> oh, you're standing really close to the water there. My friend. One more for the socials. Make sure the exposure isn't all blown out this time. Will I be allowed to kill you? Will they see? We're gonna wait for Te Ken. Oh, this guy's got to get out of here as well. Big guy. Okay. Where's Ken? Ken! Oh, he's gone, he's gone, he's gone. Can I... stand here with a syringe? Oh shit! Oh shit! Hello. Okay, he's dead. He didn't need to be killed by accident. Combat! Oh, shite. <laughs> no. Come in, come on. <laughs> oh, is my technique not working? Alright, I've got to let the... Let things die down. And then we'll take out the, um... The final target with the fall falling. Some 
Someone help Objet. me with this asshole. Hey, you should be doing your job. Hey, you. What seems to be the problem here? The issue is you need to help. uncompromised for those guys that are in the area where I'm going to do my killings. We'll with this troublemaker. Come on, you copy? Someone is causing a public commotion. Yep, Lucid Target is um, going live 2 p.m. local time next Friday. So I'll pick it up um, the week after. It's a repeat of some of, of a Hitman 1 target in Paris, which I've done twice already, I think. <laughs> what bad <laughs> we didn't make any bet? It, you, you get pride and uh, you have my respect if you're here at 4 o'clock, but please don't do it at the expense of your health. Um, <laughs> All right. Okay. I'm going to see if I can get my way back there, but I need to be real careful. Oh, I can... Ooh. Was he under it there? He might have been under it there. Who am I compromised with? No one. What? But there was combat. Ooh. No, not you, not you. Not you. Okay, so the good news is that over the other side I have the clearance to shoot this thing up. But I need to time it. Because if I can't kill him with this, then it's going to be difficult to kill him another way. And this woman likes to walk underneath it. saw me there. Alright, well that's a problem now because I have got a compromised state with them. Please, you need to leave now. But I might be still yeah, able to okay. shoot the basket from this side. Yeah, there it is, look. I just got to time it right. Compromised. I can live with compromised. In fact, I probably can do my thing from here. Yeah, look. Can I hold my gun? Okay. Yeah, I can. Here we go. So I just gotta check on the mini map there to see when he's in the middle of that bridge and then just shoot it. All right, he's by the water. Wondering where his cameraman is. Photographer. Who's... Oh, shit. Come on. Come on, Ken. I will be patient. Watching the mini-map. Ay ay ay. Don't move. I'll go check. What? Who? Like, are people spooked? Have I broken the loop? <sighs> I'm 
not sure if he actually stops on his way um, from where he is now, or if he stops when he only when he goes back from the um, thing here. What weapon? What weapon? Oh my god, everyone. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. Lots of unfriendly people outside. Shit, have I broken this now? Probably could have restarted and done it as quickly. Come on, come on. Because I can't even get in there. <laughs> I can't even get in there <laughs> to leave a coin for him to pick up. Because I have a compromised person in this space. Oh, but he's not looking. He just walked back to his... No, no, he's going now! It's great! Yes, he stopped. He has stopped. Oh. And he is dead. And I'm on my way home. <laughs> oh, okay. Now oh, I don't have the boat key. Taking a long way around. You don't have to remind me every minute. Every minute. way around. I think so. Cool. So that's the end of these Valentine's Day challenges. Good fun. Which one's next? Um, yeah. Excellent. 